Allie Tutina with OWTV. I'm here at the Amelia Wallace Gallery where the exhibit being shown is Portraits of Love, Memories of Home. We met with the two photographers being shown, John Bentham and Rick Garrity, to talk a little bit about the exhibit. I work with um, PMDA and they approached me and asked me if I was interested in doing uh, a photo shoot with uh, deployed military families. Um, I have a son that's a, a Marine who's on his second combat deployment in Afghanistan. So it was pretty much a no-brainer for me to get involved. The, the project was interesting. It was, uh, the, the premise of the project is, is portraits of families for deployed servicemen, service women. John and I set up two studios, uh, one with the white background, one with the black background, uh, just to change things up. Uh, neither one of us are portrait photographers. We just kind of, you know, we did this and we wanted to kind of show the kids having fun and the families being themselves. I know as, as a uh, deployed military father, uh, I'd like to see my family uh, being themselves. The one over here with the little girl with the, the daddy doll and it, it's, it, it's, there's a, there's a company where you upload a picture and they, of, of you know, she, uh, her mom obviously uploaded a picture of the daddy, they print it on a little doll and then sew it up and send it to her. And, you know, she walked in and, and, you know, she's clutching this little doll and it, you know, right away like, wow, you know, what's this? And her mom's, oh, she, you know, it's her, it's her daddy. She never goes anywhere without it. She sleeps with it. And that was it. I mean, I almost, you know, I almost lost it. You know, it, it's that right there, that one story just kind of brought home the whole project, you know, why, why we did this. You know, I mean, we drove 18 hours. We're down there shooting for two days, you know, doing all this work. And that's the point. This little guy... His, he came in with his mom, and uh, he was very, very shy. He started out in John's room, and he was photographing. Uh, John was photographing him and his, uh, his mom, and he came with me. And we walked over to uh, the room with the white background. I asked him to just, uh, I said, here, just hold this flag for a second, and uh, I'll be with you in a minute. I had to switch my camera over because I, I, I changed cards. So I'm changing the card, and as I look up, this was the pose that he was in the middle of. Uh, so I just grabbed my camera, took two quick shots, and then after he knew that I was taking his picture, he turned and smiled. And, and the smiling pictures are great, but this was my favorite. It was like, he looks like the poster boy for a future military, you know, and his mom was crying when I took this picture. There's many, many service members around the world that aren't, able to see their families more than once a year if they're lucky. And that, that's hard. I mean, I, I've got a little boy, he's four years old, and if I don't see him for three days, you know, I kind of miss him. It's, you know, you know he's trouble, but, but you know, so it, it, we'd, we'd have people come in, you know, they, little boys, you know, little four-year-old boys, they hadn't, they hadn't seen their dad in a year. So it's, it, it was kind of a, a real heart-wrenching project, and, and that was kind of why, why I got into it. John and Rick truly showed what it means to give back during the holidays with this heartwarming gallery. They plan to do it again next year, and OWTV will surely be there to report it. This has been Ali Tutino.